Now here's the theorem about an excribed triangle. That is, if you start with one triangle and put a second triangle so that the sides of the second triangle touch the vertices of the first triangle. So we want to do an excribed triangle whose sides are parallel to the medians of the original triangle. And we're going to um, show that the area of the excribed triangle is three times the area of the original triangle. So let me draw my original triangle. And I will um, constrain its lengths. That A, make that B, and make that C. I am now going to create the medians. There's two ways to create the median. One is to find the midpoint of the side and join it up to the opposite vertex. But a shortcut is to select both the vertex and the side. And then the midpoint gives you both the midpoint and the median um, all at once. So now we would like an excribed triangle. So it's going to look like this. This this. Well, I haven't made it quite excribed. We've got to specifically constrain B uh, to lie on GH there. Then we use the incidence constraint, this one here. Uh, likewise, I constrain C to lie on HI using the incidence constraint. And A to lie on GI again with the incidence constraint. Having done that, we now need to make the sides parallel to the medians. So we make this side parallel to this median using the parallel constraint. And we can make this side parallel to this median again using the parallel constraint. And finally, we make this side parallel to this median with the parallel constraint. Having done that, we want to look at the area of GHI. Well, in fact, we'd like to look at the area of GHI relative to the area of ABC. So let's do that. And we see the answer is three.